Hey guys, welcome back to another Game Gear Game History. This time we're playing Mado Monogatari 3 Q Kyo Ku uh, Ju Sama. Or, uh, well, my name is Arlie. I'm on my way to the Ancient Magic School. I've been traveling for three days with my cute little friend Carby. Are you hungry, Carby? Goo goo. Hand over Carbuncle quietly. And I might spare your life. I packed lunch. Wanna eat now? Goo goo. Hold it right there, Missy. Huh? Are you talking to me? There's no one else here, is there? Um, do I know you? My name is Rulu. Rulu E. Oh, well, I missed it. It's going to be me. Okay. Stop playing dumb. The fact you have Carbuncle with you is proof you are betrothed to Lord Satan. Well, uh, actually, I just knocked him out cold and left him somewhere inside Lyra's labyrinth. What'd you just say? Unforgivable. Come forth, Minotaurus. Can't beat that. Let's hightail it out of here, Carby. Don't move. Come here. No thanks. I said don't move. This was me and Pitfalls. And so... I fell straight into Ruli's Ruli's trap. All right, the English name is Sorcery Saga Three. Um, it was released on November twenty fifth, nineteen ninety four, in Japan. It is a Japanese exclusive, and uh, yeah, I let's check it out. Usually with game histories, I play five to twenty minutes and just show off the games a little bit. That was your intro to this game. So let's get this checking out and see what it's like. It's an RPG. So let's see what we're dealing with here. Oh. Well, I skipped that, guys. I didn't mean to, but that's okay. Uh, so it's basically... Okay, I've played one of these before. There's a message on the door. Uh, Monsters on Patrol. So it's kind of like a dungeon crawler where you move around in a dungeon type. I, I kind of love the way it's controls a little bit. It's kind of cool. What's it going to be, Ribbit? Uh, what you say? This is on the floor. Seven keys will open a new path. Alright. We'll just look around. The door is locked. What'd you say? Holy fast enter. This door is seven keyholes. Okay, that's where the keys go. There's a chest. Yep. Might be a trap. Oh, bon Chad. What's he say? You feel a presence. Oh, a rock puyo falls with a loud thud. Well, we can use his magic, right? He's rock. So, I assume Rock gets hurt by wind. Okay, maybe that is not what that meant. It fires my attack. It was smashed to piece. I kind of feel bad for it, poor little thing. I want my head again. 
I'm gonna go all the way to the end here. Yes. Focus herbs! Yeah. Oh, got one of the keys! Two of the keys? Oh! A nuisance Puyo draws near. Looks strong. Ugh. Maybe we'll try ice on him? Psst. That was some big damage. Feeling super good. What's this? The monster, you should start saving your magic. Kinda hurt. It said I should save my magic, that's why I didn't attack it. Okay, I'm gonna go just up this way now. Oh, open it, yeah. Another key. It's three of them. There's what, seven? I'm trying to go around like the edge of the map. Four of them. Oh no. He spilled some sticky goo. Oh, the nuisance splattered all over. Oh, is that the beginning where I started at? I don't think so. What do you sell? Wizard one. So it brings back my magic, maybe. I have no idea. I'm where the. I'm back at the beginning. All right. Oh, another rock. Bye bye, Rock Pure. I'm about to level. Alright, let's go around this way. What chest? Five? Oh, another Rock Pure. They seem to be pretty easy to take out, so I don't mind. I'm gonna level soon. Level up! I'm gonna actually go through the center. Oh no. These guys are kind of strong. Got him. Got some veggies too. Oh. Ooh. 
Why is it not dying? This one don't want to die for some reason. Turn what to Yo 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 yo. All right. Here, luck is hailed. There's a chest there. Okay, there's number six. Now, if I can figure out where number seven's at, we'll be good to go. Dragon Claw? Is that like something I can equip? Is it Dragon Claw? Like I can't equip it? Carby, you must be starving. Alright. And he dies. And I leveled again. I just gotta find this one. Last chest. Maybe this away? I remember there was a chest here because it said it didn't want to open it because of a trap. There it is. There's all the keys. Now let's find that exit. Right here. Let's see what's in there. Another chest. Uh, those veggies are for him. I got three veggies. I'll get rid of one of them. Danger ahead. Are you ready? Stairs going down. Alright guys, I'm going to call it right here. It's usually what I do when I play games is I just play them for a little bit. I did the whole first floor. That's pretty much how this game plays. It is a lot of fun. Like, it's different. It's not your traditional, like, it has random battles, but it's not your traditional overhead RPG. It's like more of like a first person dungeon crawling. Kind of similar to like um, Eye of the Beholder style, which I find this to be a lot of fun. It's actually a lot of fun to play. Uh, if you ever get a chance, I definitely recommend playing it. I'll continue some more game histories in the future and uh, boss cutscenes. I do those as well. Going through the entire Game Gear library. Check out my channel. I have did all of 96 and I'm just putting up the last of all the games of 95 because I'm going backwards. Both English and Japanese. So, uh, yeah. Until next time, keep up the positivity. <laughs>